After the Baltimore Bridge collapsed earlier today, preliminary investigations point to an accident. Maryland's Governor Wes Moore in a conference here today said that the investigating authorities haven't seen any credible evidence of a terror attack. There were more than 22 Indians on board, according to Synergy Marine Group. The company also informed that all the crew members, including the two pilots, have been accounted for. And there are no reports of any injuries on board. And the crew of the cargo ship that hit the bridge told the Coast Guard about propulsion and control issues that helped get the word out to limit traffic on the bridge. Two people were pulled out alive earlier this morning from the freezing waters. One is hospitalized. Now, Maryland's congressional delegation has reached out to key federal officials. The National Transportation Safety Board is also on the scene and are carrying out an extensive investigation. President Biden has also been briefed this morning and he's expected to pledge to provide any federal support that Baltimore needs. Now, the focus, of course, right now remains on the victims of this accident and the search for those in the water. But ultimately, decisions will have to be made related to a new bridge and rebuilding here. In Baltimore, Rena Parthwad.